Hey guys, welcome back to the stream. I'm gonna bring myself up a bit here. Oh, everything look okay? I hope everything looks okay. All right, we're on turn 16 here. We gotta keep going. You wanna know if these are full graphics? Uh, Nanook Rubes. Uh, let's have a look. Options. Uh, graphics. Show advanced options. I think uh, it's pretty much full, except it's not 1080p because I have to run at a slightly lower resolution. It's upscaling to 1080. But in terms of uh, graphics, it's pretty much... It's not full full, um, but it's pretty full. Like all of this is... A lot of things are... are quite full. Yeah, this is this is very close to max graphics, without mods. Okay, am I? Yeah, everything's okay, right? Okay. By the way, uh, let me know if the the stream looks okay. Oh, the the mouse is now contained into the window. That's good. Okay, so we were gonna check out this barbarian camp. This guy, uh, where did I want to send him to scout? I'm gonna send him north, along the coast. And I'm gonna get a builder. We're gonna grab this goody hut. 20 faith. We have 40 faith now. Okay. At zero faith per turn. When do we get to choose a pantheon? Do we get to choose it now? I'm not sure. Oh, we got a tech. Uh, we got astrology just completed. We should get animal husbandry for the elephants. Choose a pantheon. We get to choose a pantheon. So, huh. Holy site districts get plus one faith from adjacent tundra tiles. Our capital is not exactly... on tundra. River goddess, plus one amenity if cities if they ho have a holy site adjacent to a river. 15% production towards ancient and classical wonders, great person points from holy sites, production from fishing boats, marsh oasis, floodplains, pastures, camps, mines, luxuries, bonuses. Plus two faith from quarries. We do have... We have one stone there. We got two stone up there, but not a lot. I've not properly looked at this before. Uh, faith in mines, luxury bonus resource, goddess festival, plus food from... Wine, incense, cocoa, tobacco, uh huh. Plus one productions from mines, uh huh. Ancient and classical military units, God of the Forge. 50 faith when barbarian outposts is cleared. Healing in your holy site districts or any adjacent tiles. Bonus faith. City growth is 10% higher. Water expansion rate is 15% higher. Hmm. We probably don't need that. City growth rate plus is probably good. Because it's just a a good thing to have. I don't have a lot of any specific resource, so I think I'm gonna go for that. Fertility rates. Okay, found this pantheon. Okay, Worship of Pantheon brought up further... Uh -huh. Mysticism boosted. Okay, fantastic. Let's keep going. So we got uh, 20 faith from... No, we got Without 40 faith from the Barbarian camps. No, from the Goody Huts. Shaken in the wind. Ooh, okay. We've got craftsmanship. Got policies. I think... Uh, Production in all cities, I think that's fine. I think this is fine. We still got some barbarians coming in. Yeah, that's fine. Is that? That's fine, right? Okay. Choose a civic? Okay. Oh, what, what are we going for? Trade, military, tradition? Hmm. State, workforce. What are we going for here? Ooh, we should try and go for early empire, right? We'll need foreign trade for that. Let's just get foreign trade. All right, and we got a builder. Yes, okay. And from this, I think we can go ahead and... Should we get a settler? Let's get a settler. We're supposed to be playing wide. So we got a builder. 
we'll need to improve a few things. We don't have animal husbandry quite yet, so we're gonna go ahead and get the stone. Wait, what? No, let's... how do I... We're on this guy. We should probably heal up, but I kind of want to keep scouting. We'll keep scouting. So we could find the city down here on that river. Okay, now let's go ahead and get this set up. We should get animal husbandry soon enough, and we can get decisive victory on this guy. Ah. This is my largest stream so far, so sorry if I can't keep up with chat. <laughs> We didn't kill it. Oh, damn. Sent a delegation to a city. Please enjoy the churros and welcome them kindly. Okay. Most welcome. We're not looking for a war quite yet. You hate the early game because it's so slow? Yeah, but it's my first game. I can't skip the early game. <laughs> my first game. Who, who needs... Okay, so this. Can we... Build a quarry, yes, plus one production. Masonry advance, fantastic. Now, actually, I have not looked at the city. Like, we can focus toggle city details. Manage citizens. So they're currently working this, this, and this. Okay, that seems fine. We can, we can focus, right? Okay, we can focus certain things. Okay, you... We'll just, yeah, we'll just explore a bit more. At least until, yeah. I think my first city is going to go up here. Grab this uh, natural wonder. Now, where did that guy go? Two scouts? What happened to the... Oh, that's a slinger. I'm going to go here. I think someone... Oh, no, the barbarian camp is still there. Okay. It seems like they were fighting someone, which is why... Um, they haven't attacked us yet. Because we were scouted out. Gilgamesh! Gilgamesh. Gilgamesh. Two-thirds god, they say he is. I am Gilgamesh of Sumeria and king of Uruk. Do not be afraid, I am good to my friends. Let's be friends then. He's a good one to ally with because of his uh, war bonuses. The glory of Sumer of, yeah, is yours to see if you wish an ancient tradition of arts and sciences. Ziggurats too! Great to behold. We'd love to sample your hostility. Where are they? Is that them? He's right there. So there's... Spain's up there. Gilgamesh is there. So we are pretty close here. Okay. Unit needs orders. You. Uh, we should kill... He took the barbarian camp. That is his, uh... His bonus, I guess. Let's... Kill the scout. If anything, they're harder to catch up with. Stream is unstable? How is the stream for you guys? Can we fortify... Oh, promotion available. Let's, uh... Ooh. Melee and range unit when defending against range attack. Let's go battle cry. That means you can keep scouting. Very good. We've got our builder. We're going to get animal husbandry in one turn. Can we... A little tricky here. Gonna have to get you over there. We're building a settler, right? Yeah. Stream looks okay? Okay. As long as- if it's fine for some of you, that means, uh, if anyone's lagging, it's- it's on your side. Because I'm not dropping any frames. The quality might be a little low, I'm not sure. I've never streamed Civ 6, so I don't know what the stream looks like. The delegation of Gilgamesh brings you gifts of Sumerian jewelry and lyres from Ur. Will you accept them into your city? Your delegation is most welcome. I would like to ally with Gilgamesh. He seems like a good ally. Good, strong, early game ally if uh things go well we might uh be able to if there are no dogs hold back heaven, spain then when i die i want to go where they went animal husbandry got him okay uh what should we go for 
Why is there no... There's no scroll bar on this. Um, let's see what we're actually looking for here. Farmer resource. We're actually not doing that. Let's go writing. So we're here now. It looks like they're taking out a bunch of the barbarians there. That's sugar. We should probably bring this guy back for our settler. Right? Is that a barbarian camp that just cropped up, like, right there, where I wanted to settle my city? That's not fair. It's gonna take so long to bring our units back. So, I'm gonna use this. Scout versus Scout, which is... it says Major Victory. That seemed pretty equal, actually. So this barbarian camp has set up exactly where I want my uh, my city to be. And I'm building a settler now, which is a little awkward. Spain is worshipping a pantheon of the gods focused on the god of the forge belief. Oh, that means he's going for early game aggression. That's a little scary. Okay, so... We could settle here. We'll bring this guy up. So here we're gonna get this. Pastures. Horseback riding advanced considerably. Fantastic. Horses are up there. So my scout probably... I'll keep my scout around here, not too far away, in case we need a little bit of backup. One turn till our settler. I wonder if we can buy a warrior next turn. We are true friends with the smaller civilizations. We appreciate that you recognize this fact. Is that a compliment or an insult? I really don't know. Uh, those Gilgamesh units are a little close for comfort. Those are his unique units, right? Those are the war carts. Do they count as cavalry? Plus one bonus due to difficulty. That's a king difficulty, right? I have a feeling I should start bringing my units back a little bit. All right, so this guy I'm gonna send over here. We're gonna improve those elephants for a luxury resource. We have a settler, but we can't bring it up there because the barbarians are in the way. Can I... Slingers take one turn. We got so much production. Lavras two turns. Alright, it's a unique district. Unique districts build faster. Uh, maybe I should have gone a bit more military. Movement two, movement two. I'd like another warrior. Can I buy? How do you buy a warrior? Purchase. 100 gold. It's worth it. Okay, so producing. Where's a good spot for a holy site? On that hill, right? With the, the mountains. Mm. Let's build the lava. Let's get a district. So here is pretty much the best spot. We're going to place it right there. Yep. Since it's done in two turns, that's fine. So this settler... I want to bring it up there. Create escort formation with the warrior. Yes, let's do that. So if I move the warrior... Oh, it, it takes up the turn, is it? Okay, it takes up the turn. It says major victory. Plus five advantage versus barbarians. It's because of our... Our civic. Okay, we'll eventually win that battle. Now, where are these war carts going? They're sort of heading towards me, which is, uh, not pleasant. Okay, you are moving down this way. Oh, that's a... Do barbarian scouts capture builders? Ooh, I really don't know. 
If that's... Hmm. You just stay there for now. I'm gonna move you up this way. So that's what it looks like when units are paired. So let's, uh... Let's bring the scout back down this way. I really hope Gilgamesh does not attack me. <laughs> I don't know what his agenda is. Can we see his agenda? Uh, ally of Enkidu, like civilizations who are willing to form long-term alliances. Dislikes people who denounces or attacks his friends and allies. Okay. Okay, he's going religion, I think. If he declares a surprise war here, I don't know if... <laughs> he's, uh, he's moved into my lands. Now, there is no... Um, Borders. Borders don't count. Oh, we, we lost our scout. Okay. Uh, we've uh, inspired state workforce. Writing is easy. All you have to do is cross out the wrong words. Every nation lives by exchanging. Okay, good. So, Sumeria is all up in my lands. <laughs> Not uh, the most pleasant thing. Our defense here is actually pretty good because of the river and our city being on a hill. But, uh, what should we go for on technology? Ancient walls seems like a good idea. And I should probably, just in case, purchase another military unit. Let's purchase... What's, uh... What's good? Let's get a slinger. Then, civic. Uh, state workforce unit maintenance reduced. We might need that, actually. Early Empire. Military tradition grants flanking and support combat bonuses to all combat units. I think we need that. Okay. And we're gonna need to produce something here. I think we should produce another warrior. We've got the Lavra up. So we're getting two Faith per turn. I'm just really concerned. Are they going to attack us? I don't know how the AI behaves. Unit needs orders. You guys. Let's, uh... We'll, we'll have to keep moving this guy up. This guy. I think to be safe, I'm going to bring this guy down this way. So if they attack us, they have to attack across the river, which is uh, going to be a little difficult. You fortify until healed, I guess. We're going to keep bringing this guy back. Oh. Next turn. Is he going to attack us? I don't know. I should have focused on this, right? Build this camp before something happens to you. Yeah, okay, good. All right, you, I'm bringing back this way. Now, these units are all over my, my terrain here, which is not so pleasant. I'm going to bring you up this way. We need to clear out that camp. So I'm going to wake this guy up, bring you up here. Yeah, borders don't exist until you get uh, early empire, I think. So we got this uh, slinger here, and I'm just gonna fortify the slinger in my city. So we at least have something there. Next turn. They're moving away. Okay, good. That's getting a little close. My liege, 
We are beginning to attract the attention of the great people of the world. Of course, there are other leaders vying for their attention too. Awesome. Why are we doing that? The more specialized districts we construct, the more we will draw in specialized great people to share their talents with our civilization. I advise that we continue to build these. All right. Good. So wait, do we get great people points just from... Where is the great person screen? Here. Okay. So cannot recruit. You need a coastal city. Okay. So what are we... Here, Russia. Two great profit points a turn from districts. Okay. Okay. I'm, <laughs> this is my first game. I'm still trying to understand everything. So what are we doing here? Choose production. Mm. Stonehenge. Not, no suitable construction to build this. What kind of terrain does this need? Must be adjacent to stone. We have stone, but... It needs to be on flat land, right? If I remember correctly. Oh well. Projects, shrine, campus, granary. We should probably get a granary at this point. Help our city grow a little bit. So we got this guy. I'm gonna bring him back. Because I'm just concerned about all this military stuff around me. And you... yeah. And I want to move this guy up first. And move you up here. The forest will keep us safe. Ooh, there's crabs out there, which probably means... I don't know. It, oh, it is still in three towers from the coast, so maybe there's no land out there. And this is our warrior? Why can't I attack... Wait. Okay. Here's my warrior. Here's the barbarian scout. Why can't I attack it? What am I not understanding here? I can move here, I can move here, but I can't attack this unit? Okay, maybe next turn. Okay, Sumeria seems to be backing out now, so that should be good. But just in case, I'm going to keep this warrior around here, because Sumeria's got the slingers over there. And I'm going to bring this guy here, and bring up our warrior and settler there. Okay, that should be enough to clear out the barbarian camp and get our city up. Oh, Daniel Hunsberger. Thank you for that. I couldn't attack with the warrior because if I failed, the warrior would go back into my city and I'll have two units in my city, which means uh, that's not allowed. Okay. Andrew Lamar. If only he will read chat. We want to help. Saw your, your, saw your message. <laughs> chat seems to have slowed down a little bit, which means I can, uh, I can read some of it. So if you have tips and hints and all of that, do let me know. Some of you, I'm sure, are way more into uh, into the game. Um, but I, I'm not going to see everything. Okay, so we did lose our scout. So I should be careful. Um, these two war cuts are still hanging around here. So I want you... Okay, we're going to cause a stalemate here just to weaken these guys. Okay, 34 damage to 30 damage. So I can attack with this. Major victory. Okay, next turn they'll be dead. Now, I don't know where this scout is from. I worry about another barbarian camp down here somewhere. We are true friends with the smaller civilizations. We appreciate that you recognize this fact. Why is everyone calling me a small civilization? Is it because of the number of cities? Bravery is being the only one who knows you're afraid. Okay. 
production towards cavalry, naval units, classical air, melee, and range units. I think I'm, I'm still fighting barbarians, it's fine. How about economic policies? Trade routes, builders, faith and gold in the capital. We're okay on faith on gold for now, we'll keep the production. Choose civic. Okay, what are we going for? Grow your civilization to at least six pop? This is growing in one. And we're gonna put down a city. I don't know how long that'll take to to get, but uh, early empire is quite important. Build any district. We have boosted this. We need this to go to political philosophy anyway. So let's grab that. That'll give us time to get the boost for the other one. Choose production. Campus, shrine. It's recommended I build a campus. I don't have any good spot for the campus, actually. Campuses get... Like, districts get adjacency bonuses for being next to the capital, right? Or being next to other districts. So I would get plus two there. Oh, the capital counts... Okay, being adjacent to other districts is plus half. I think that's correct. That's why there's plus two here. But I'd have to get rid of the sheep to do it. I'd get plus one there. That's hills. That would remove the woods. I'd get plus two there. Why do I get plus two? Oh, there's a mountain there. I could purchase that tile and then build it there. It's a little exposed, but uh, it'll be the best for now. Uh, decisions. Let's go for it. Got it. Done it. Did it. Maybe it's a bad decision. I don't know. Oh well. It's fine. Okay. So this is major victory. Will I die? Like, okay. Minus 8 damage unit. Let's use this guy to, to kill. Fantastic. Does that actually unlink the unit? Bronze working advance, fantastic. It does not unlink the unit. So I'm gonna build a city right there. Horses, silk, natural wonder, um, whale, whale, crabs, coastal city, just out of range of the coffee. I might want to build a city here somewhere. Oh. You can see that I can't build a city here, which means Sumeria has built a city somewhere here. So within three towers, right? One, two, three. I think there's a city here. One, two, one, two, three. Yeah, there's a city right there. I might want to get a city here or maybe further south, long here maybe. In the tundra. Okay. So I'm chasing this guy down. That's fish, not whale. Oh, they are... F Why does a fish look like whales? John Hackett, thank you for pointing that out. Those are fish, not whales. That icon just sort of looks like a whale. <laughs> if you squint, it looks like a whale. Okay, you. Promotion is available. Combat strength. Yes. That's good. And you. We could try and see where that city is. There it is. Told you there was a city there. I would settle here, but there's not much food. That sugar's a luxury resource. Coffee is a luxury resource. Those are luxuries and stone, so there's actually not much food going around there. Whales are light blue fish. Uh, whales are light blue, fish are dark blue. Okay, that's a good way to, to see it. Your Grace, we have obtained greater knowledge in the art of building static fortifications. Building walls around our cities will not only make them stronger against a foreign invader, but will also allow them to bombard nearby enemies. Each of us is carving a stone, erecting a column, or cutting a piece of stained glass in the construction of something much bigger than ourselves. We've got masonry. That sounds good. Choose research. Okay, what are we actually going for here? So we've got masonry. We should probably get bronze working. Allows the barracks, encampment, spearmen, iron. 
the wheel... Oh, we haven't mined a resource. Yeah, let's go for bronze working. That's strange. It said seven turns just now, but when I clicked on it, it said six turns. Okay, six is better. Alright, first I want to settle this city. Found city. So, because we are Russia, look at that land. Look how much it takes up. The whole... Like, it smartly took it up as well. I thought it was just a, an even, like, it took in all directions. No, it actually took the resources we needed and the natural wonder. And it skipped these tiles. So it did this sort of H shape. That's fantastic. Oh, hopefully the city is, is good. How do I see the city details? So it's one of the three housing capacity. So we need more housing, but uh, we should just get a builder... Ooh, it takes a while to get a builder. It takes a while to get everything. Just get a builder. So we've got this unit. We'll scout up here a bit. So Sumeria is right there. Kish, size one city. And you, promotion available. Comment strike when defending against range attacks. Nah, it's a battle cry. We have so many units. We are gonna trap this guy though. Make sure he can't get home. Ah, there's the bar barbarian camp. So we'll make sure the scout doesn't get home. Build granary in new city for housing? That's true. Granaries give housing. So there's Kish. You can see his borders are now solid, which means we can't traverse into his lands. But at least we've caught up. So I'm playing on king difficulty, which means the AI is slightly boosted up. We'll fortify you there. We'll keep our cities safe. Attack this scout, please. Don't think we'll kill him. Use a slinger to kill a unit to advance archery? Yeah. Um, I, sh I could actually... If I bring out my slinger... Chase down that guy. He can't move here because of zone of control. Oh, it actually shows whose turn it is right now up here. I think. Okay. We'll keep scouting out these lands here. Yeah? That is... What is that? Oh, that's his... Um, his, uh, his ziggurat. Right, okay. Okay, so we've got this slinger. We're gonna move you here. And we're gonna move you here. Actually, no, let's just... Do you think we could uh, take this camp? Let's uh, fortify until healed. Oh, we can attack straight away. There we go. That should, uh, that should boost our archery. Fantastic. Good thing I built that slinger. Our borders are still not solid, so Sumerian war carts are just sort of hanging out in our religious district there. <laughs> Nashika says, thank you for making my day better. Glad I could do that for you. That's sort of like at least 50% for why I make videos and stream because people like it. Ah. Sizo Sizo says, Hi Zach. Hello. Or is it Sizo Sizo? I'm not too sure. Anyway, uh, we have boosted early empire. Fantastic. Just in time. Uh, we're about to complete stately workforce. Now, I should keep this warrior unit between Sumeria and myself to keep an eye on uh, where he's going. Now, this is a Vilnius unit. Let's keep chasing down this Barbarian. We can bring you back to our city. That warrior is train, uh, healing up. So, this city has already grown. If we... Uh, nine turns until the Builder. How much is it to... to buy a Builder? 
140. It's kind of expensive, but we do have a lot. So that requires irrigation. We do have a lot to improve. I'm going to buy a builder. So we will get the horses strategic resource. I don't know if that that's boosted. Let's uh Hmm. We need irrigation for the silk. What is um what what is this how do I manage citizens? What is it currently? Hmm. How do I? How do, I'm still not used to the interface. How do I get out of this? Um, toggle suit. Okay, there we go. Does this have a movement point? No. Okay. Next turn. I think I'll do the the sea resources. Who is Spain is sending in units? Oh, down this way. Can I have a look at uh, Spain's agenda here? Like civilizations who follow the same religion and wants his cities to all follow the same religion. Hates anyone trying to spread their religion into his empire. Okay. So he's gonna definitely play the religion game. Mathematics has advanced because... Why, why is this advanced? It is equally important to have a happy and engaged workforce as it is to have a profitable bottom line. Okay. Do I want to change policies? I'm not really going against barbarians anymore right now. Unit maintenance reduced is probably a good one. And I'm not really... Yeah, that's going to be good. Production, wonders, gold from trade routes, builders. Faith, gold in the capital. I think it's fine. So we're currently getting plus 7.4. It is now going to not change at all because we don't have any expense from unit maintenance. I should have checked that first, right? I should have checked that first. Anyway, choose a civic. Where are we going? Early empire, right? Because I want to get to political philosophy. What does this allow? The Oracle Wonder, culture and faith. That might be good to grab after this. Choose production here. I really should get walls, right? The AI seems to be quite aggressive. Let's get walls. We're gonna send you down this way, deal with those barbarians. It's interesting how the barbarian camps are all defended by spearmen, which are countered by warriors. Anyway, we have a builder. And I would build... No, I wasn't going for this. Oh, I, I need sailing to get on... Right, I need sailing to do that. I boosted sailing, right? Okay, I might want to get that next. But I can't improve this because... Uh, a unit's on it. So I'm going to send this guy down here, build a farm. Because that should be useful anyway. Okay, Vilnius takes up to the coast there. I'm going to bring this guy back here because Spain's doing some weird things. We'll get bronze working next turn, which will reveal iron. Spain sending quite a few units down. We do have our fair share bronze of units. is the mirror of the form. Wine of the mind. Choose the research. Uh, archery is available, but... I want sailing to quickly get those resources boosted. I'm going to bring this guy back. Vilnius looks nice. Uh, these guys are sort of blocking my way. I'm going to send them around this way. You are going to fortify right there. I'm going to bring this guy over here. Iron is there. Two iron deposits. Oh, oh, I see. Tundra tiles and iron. I think we need a city down here, but there's no food. If I build a... One, two, three. If I build a city here, it would just... Uh, just a bit reach that iron resource. It'll be in Tundra. There's lots of food over on that side. I think I have to build a city there. Okay. I'm getting walls there. I'm worried about this city. I think I need to 
put walls everywhere because Samaria and Spain are just everywhere. Provides housing. Okay, that's gonna be useful. So I'm gonna do this. Yes. Place a farm down there. We'll get sailing in two turns, so then I can send the worker out this way. Grabbing this uh, natural wonder is... Uh, I'm very happy about that, though. <laughs> okay, this guy's done. We're gonna... We're gonna bring him back, but I kind of wanna... I wanna place him in a place where I can keep an eye on all of this, like here. I don't like how they're... They're just sort of hanging around. Okay, so sailing will be done next turn. Perfect, so I can do this. That copper is in range. Major defeat. Oh, damn. We can't win against these guys. Because I changed up my... My policies. I guess I could just fortify right here. Preventing the barbarians from coming up this way. That seems like a good idea. And... I have not explored this interface at all. We get one influence points per turn. What are reports? Too many numbers right now. Next turn. Ronza asks, well, Ronza149 asking, difficulty level I'm playing? It's king. Uh, completing walls, boosted engineering. It is not that life ashore is distasteful to me. But life at sea is better. Fantastic. Look back over the past with its changing empires. We've got solid borders. Look at that. And you can foresee the future too. Fantastic. So we probably want to put back this because we have no unit maintenance right now. Minus three from cities. Hmm. So we're going to put back combat against barbarians. Production towards builders. Uh, no, I don't think. Reduce the cost of purchasing a tile. No, we're not doing that right now. That's fine. Okay, so we could wake this guy up. Minor defeat. It looks like we will not win if we fight this guy. Might need to wait for a bit more. Technology tree. We got sailing. Irrigation will be handy for that silk. Farmer resource. We actually did not have any resources to farm. I don't want to... I could jump into the classical era with horseback riding. Let's get irrigation. Four turns. Not too long. And civics. We are now... We could get mysticism. Unlocks the oracle. I don't know if we'll be able to get that. We might want to chop down some trees to rush the oracle. Because I, I want to build a, a wonder. Choose production. We've built a campus. Which I guess... Do we get... Uh, plus 7.1. Does having a campus just boost our, our science? Just by having it? Or do we need a library? Mm. What do we need? Plus one amenities, housing capacity is fine. It's telling me to build an encampment. I totally could. Or I could build a library. It costs one gold per turn. Battering ram. That's a lot of military units right there, right? Should I put the encampment on this side or this side? The, if it's here, they have to attack across the river or they come from the marsh. That's a good place for it. I'm building an encampment. Right there. Because look at this. There's one, two, three, four, five, six, seven enemy military units here. And they're all just hanging out. I'm going to move this guy onto this hill. And you now have sailing, 
so let's go ahead and grab these crabs. And you... I'm gonna bring back this way. Look at all these Spanish units on this side of Vilnius and the Sumerians. It's not good. Huh. Encampment between the rivers would do great versus the upcoming war. <laughs> it does look like there's an upcoming war, right? I need to get some city walls in... Uh, what is my second city? Vor... Voronez? Voronez? Okay. So we're going to bring this guy back to this side of the river. You are going to improve that. And you are going to come down here. Okay. We're getting irrigation, which will allow us to harvest all this silk. That build is done in five turns. When is this going to grow? Four turns until growth. Manage citizens. It's currently taking that and that. We're getting culture. Maybe we should focus on production. That. Wait. Two turns. No, I want that. Unlock that. Put that there. This is just better. For now. We don't need the culture. Okay, that's uh, another Sumerian war cart. <laughs> is this on a hill? Yeah, I'm gonna leave this warrior here to defend my campus district. You are gonna make your way over to those fish. There is a bit of land over there. Good to know. And you, I'm gonna... New continent discovered. Our explorer is naming it Asia. So is that a new continent? It is. We're on the purple continent. That's the white continent. Okay, you I'm going to bring back to help defend our second city. Just having a second unit around there is going to be good. I would be playing wider, but I'm just so worried about this war. Mysticism is the mistake of an accidental and individual symbol for a universal one. My All right. liege, we have an envoy at our disposal. We can use the envoy to gain favor with the city-state. Becoming friendly with a city-state neighbor can be greatly beneficial to our civilization. Fantastic. We're not fighting barbarians. Do we have unit maintenance? We do not have unit maintenance. We don't have recon units. We don't have naval units. I guess... Uh, bonus towards classical, ancient and classical era melee and ranged units. I guess we'll just do that. That's just better than what we have. Confirm. So this city has grown. It's now taking there. We don't have to lock that. It prefers that. 20 turns until growth. 13 turns until growth. No, let's do this. 20 turns is quite a while. But it seems to be focusing production. I'm gonna stick to that. Civics tree. And we're going to the classical era. So, we need political philosophy. Sounds good. Wait, how do I... How do I bring that up? To boost is meet three city-states. Okay, I did not meet three city-states. We're kind of locked in, actually. Maybe there's another one down there? Unlikely. I think that's the end of the continent. We never got past the Sumerians. But we can send an envoy. What? Who do we want? Plus four gold in every commercial hub district. Okay. Plus two culture in every theater square district. We have no envoys here. We have one there. Plus four gold in the capital. That's why we're, we're staying okay. Those are focusing on commercial hubs. I think I just want to get one here. Get that plus two culture straight away. 
How do I confirm placement? That seems good. And we're going to bring this guy back to... Actually, no, we could just leave him here. We'll keep an eye on things here. Fortify. You tread on dangerous grounds by making common cause with the city-states. Leave them to us. Ah. He's friends with that city-state. Okay, Spain doesn't like us. And Sumeria doesn't like that either. Okay. Doesn't help our position. We're gonna fortify you here. Okay, next turn. Random49558 says, You make amazing videos, bruh. Uh, thank you. <laughs> Unit needs orders. We're here. Okay. Improve this, please. Your fishermen learning how to guide their travels based on setting the night sky. Celestial navigation boosted. Fantastic. We've used up that builder. This builder's done soon. Um, to get this, do we need... Uh, I'm not sure if we need a tech to get uh, that, but we're getting irrigation next turn, which means we'll be able to get the silk, which is going to be good. Okay. I'm just trying to avoid war for now. I would love to get a third city up so I can get that iron resource and get a city Thousands in the tundra. Have lived without love. Not one without water. Okay. Good. Choose research. Do I get archery? The wheel, watermill. That might be handy. So I have horseback riding here. Stable. May not be built in an encampment district that already has a barracks. 25... Oh, this is a building into an encampment. Right. Iron working. Nine turns, four turns. Celestial navigation... The lighthouse? Must be built on a coast plus three gold. Currency. Builds the market and the commercial hub. Ooh, this is a hard choice to make. I think the great lighthouse might be good to get. And it unlocks harbor. We do have a coastal city. Improve two sea resources, that's why. Okay, yeah, let's go for that. We can we can go with the flow here. What are we building here? The encampment. Okay, it's done next turn. Encampment in place. Military training has been boosted. Okay. Choose production in this... Oh, yeah, St. Petersburg. Okay, so we've got that. Do I want to build a library? The Oracle. 12 turns. Hanging garden 7 turns. Must be adjacent to a river. Increases growth by 15% in all cities. Ooh. Great people cost 25% less faith. Districts in the city plus 2 great people. Uh-huh. Right. So if I were to build this... I thought the oracle... Oh no, this the stone hinge needed to be next to stone. Okay, this needs to be on a hill. Okay. I think I'm gonna go oracle. And... Doesn't seem to have any specific bonuses. Should I build it here, or... If I... Like, if I were to select... No. Should I build it at the back? Or here? I think here. It's not a particularly useful tile. Yeah, we're gonna build it here. I don't know if it's, it benefits from being adjacent to... the city. I don't think it does. So I'm gonna place it here. Yes. Let's start the oracle. 12 turns is quite long. I'm getting another builder. I might want to chop down some trees here. And here is done. Ancient walls, 13 turns. Maybe I 
This wasn't such a great place to build a city. <laughs> mm hmm. We can get spearmen. I don't think I need that yet. Build a lava district. That's 11 turns. Granary. I think I just need a granary. Get it growing. And this is a builder. So I'm going to bring it down this way. I want... Ooh. I want the horses. I want the silk. But I also need to chop down some trees. I want... The copper is not a strategic resource. Okay. The horses are. And this is a luxury. 12 turns. It's gonna take 4 turns just to walk down here. Okay, I'm gonna... I'm gonna go down first. We'll improve the silk, come down here, chop down some trees, go back up for the horses. That seems pretty good. Crazy Newt, I'm just confused of all this. <laughs> Chopping trees does not take charges. Ah, thank you. Giant Rao. Good to know. Next turn. So we have this encampment district, which is pretty good. What was that noise? Need more housing. Okay, we're getting a granary. An unmet player has completed Stonehenge. Okay. You are going to improve this to a plantation, providing more housing. Okay. And does that... Uh, it doesn't improve the yields. Okay. We're going to enter the classical era soon. Rumor has it that Sumeria has been targeted for a declaration of war by Japan. Okay, good. That means Sumerian units, you can go back, please. Just head on home, fight Japan, get away from me. Claim great person. Oh, damn, did we get a great person? Who did we get? A great prophet. We're gonna found a religion then. An unmet player is gonna get a great scientist though. So wait, great prophets are all the same, right? So we could pass, but I'm gonna recruit. Our populace has attracted a great prophet to our lands. Send this most holy person to our holy site and rejoice. For the time has come to found a religion for ourselves. We got a religion. <laughs> okay. And you have to... You have to do it in a... Uh, in a holy site. Okay, so I'm bringing this guy down this way. We need to chop down some trees. I would like to... Yeah, we just got to bring him down. This is another nine turns. Okay. And we have this great person. We got to send him to here. Hopefully Sumeria doesn't decide to declare war on me, considering they're at war with Japan. Why is it... Oh, okay. Yeah, that's fine. Next turn. Four more hours until it releases for the Europe. Oh, we're in the classical era. And all I ask is a tall ship and a star to steer her by. Celestial navigation. Fantastic. Still 530 people watching. That's good to know. Anyway, I just entered the classical era and I would love to split these videos up by era if possible. So we got a guiding started one, we got an ancient era, and now we're in the classical era and I'm about to found a religion. Fantastic. I'm gonna take a micro break. I don't need to take a break, so I'm just gonna go take a micro break and I'll be back in 15 seconds. So just, just wait, we'll be right back. Thank you so much for watching, hope you enjoyed it, and here's the screen.